And welcome back, Vault Dwellers. Naked Vault Dweller here with another episode of Fallout 76 news for you. And wow, what a week. Update 21 dropped, and although some interesting stuff came with it, many of us were disappointed to find out that a colossal event was pushed even further out. Now, I suppose we don't want another Faznak situation, so I'd rather they get the blooming issues fixed now than to be elbow deep and they end up pulling the plug. And Bethesda does say they hope to start the event within the next couple of weeks, so I'll be sure to keep you posted when I find out more. I do, however, want to take a moment to thank you for all your support. It's been an awesome week, and I'm glad to see that many new faces in our Discord channel. Way back 100 years ago, or 5 months ago, when I started this channel, I set the goal that if I ever made 500 subs, I'd get a new microphone. And now that I've hit 500, I've barely had a chance to tell everyone that if I make a thousand subscribers, I'll get a new PC. And with a new PC, I can make even better productions. And we're even at the freaking doorstep of 700. Awesome! And by the way, the new mic, it's on back order. It's going to be another three weeks before it gets to my door. Thanks, Amazon. And again, thank you guys for all your support. Now let's get on to the video. Some of you may already know about the latest edition of Inside the Vault, which mainly covers the upcoming QuakeCon kickoff that starts tomorrow at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I know I'll definitely be checking out some of the online events that Bethesda is sponsoring, so be sure to look for me. And if you see me, wave. And I'll wave back. And don't worry, I won't be participating in the cosplay interview. I don't think a player as sexy as I am is what they're really going for. Which reminds me, let's call Bethy Butler, my inside contact at Bethesda, to find out why I don't have a front row seat. Thank you for calling Bethesda. This is Bethy. How may I assist you? Bethy! Naked Vault Dweller, you want to tell me why I didn't get an invitation to the cosplay event at QuakeCon this year? I told you, Naked, there's just no more spots available this year for you. That's ridiculous. This is a freaking online event. Put Tim Sweeney on the line. I want to get the shit fixed. Naked, you are the one that's ridiculous. Then why is that? Because, Naked Vault Dweller, Tim Sweeney is the CEO of Epic Games, you moron. Huh. I think we got disconnected. I'll see if I can't get my producer Howard to get her back on the line. Meanwhile, QuakeCon. And I think I'm most excited to check out the run through of a colossal problem event with the folks from the development team. And I hope to have the opportunity to ask some questions of them regarding issues they've encountered with the event. I also think that the cooking show and the Fallout themed variety show might be an interesting thing to check out. Head on over to twitch.tv forward slash Bethesda and check it all out for yourself. You can also check the description down below for the full link and schedule. Have you grabbed your Bells of Billy outfit or Mr. Demonic backpack from the Atomic Shop yet? They're only there until August 10th, so grab these freebies while you can. And with update 21, we did see the kickoff to the first part of the Fortifying Atlas event. Project Alpha, and I'm hearing that some of the rewards aren't worth the community-wide effort, but I think this is a start of what looks like a promising effort to solidify players of the game, and I think there'll be even some cooler events and things to come on the horizon. Now currently, we're working to deliver 125 million scraps of steel, which was an impossible number when I first read it, before August 8th, to get the Brotherhood of Steel beret along with some other provisions. The beret will be available for grabs August 11th, but only if we successfully complete the steel challenge, which by the end of this video, we should have it. As of posting time on August 6th, we are super close to reaching our goal with 122 million pounds already delivered. Keep track of all of our progress by visiting the events page linked in the description down below. Remember, the Brotherhood of Steel camp banner is next, so starting on the 9th, we need to find all the concrete we can. And speaking of concrete, post your favorite places to get concrete down below in the comments, and I'll try to throw together a top 5 places to get concrete and have it out there for you. And with that, that's pretty much all the Fallout 76 news that I can deliver for you today. And in the meantime, this is the Naked Vault Dweller signing off. And by the way, I ordered a chicken and an egg from Amazon. I'll let you know which one gets here first. And thanks for watching. Take care.